Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Here we go. Today, find out how the price of Bitcoin has changed and what the technical indicators RSI, Stochastic RSI and MACD show. If you are unfamiliar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos below. Looking at the hourly time frame for Bitcoin, the price rapidly went down with around 4.4% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 26,068. We can see that the sellers are taking over because the volume was high, showing that this move was strong. Jumping to the hourly relative strength index, currently, the hourly RSI of 29 can be found in the lower region, meaning that the price is being more or less oversold and we can expect a comeback or for the price at least to remain stable for some time. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time but the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, which means the current trend is to the upside. Jumping to the hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the upside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate for some time and you should wait to see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. Looking at the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI is at 36, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Jumping to the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region, which means that the price is getting oversold and soon a trend change or at least some kind of consolidation could be expected. The K line is currently above the D line, which shows that the trend has shifted to the upside. Moving to the 3 hourly MACD, the MACD line is below the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the downside. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently indecisive so consolidation for some time or shifting the momentum could be expected and it is to wait to see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and the pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.